Kean Bexty here with Rebel Media. I'm in New York waiting for Greta Thunberg to arrive at port. And while I was waiting, I figured I would follow up on a story broken exclusively at the Rebel. Now, we uncovered earlier this week that a sole source contract was given to Eurasia Group, and Eurasia Group just happens to have an office in this building. Now, they sent us an email, and in doing so, committed an unforced error. They actually divulged to us that they had another contract, not just the $200,000 uh, sweetheart contract that the Trudeau government gave the Eurasia Group, which then went on to deal with Gerald Butts post politics they also had a contract in 2017 and you'll know 2017 is when Gerald Butts was still working for the Prime Minister's office so I want to ask a few questions and they're quite obvious did Gerald Butts have anything to do with those contracts was that original contract in 2017 sole sourced or not when was the first time that Eurasia Group dealt with Gerald Butts. Was it after he left politics and then they hired him? I, I kind of doubt it. I imagine it was closer to 2017. We know Gerald Butts is the one uh, running the government. He's the brains behind Justin Trudeau. I would be very surprised if Eurasia Group had no contact with him prior to when they started dealing with him after politics. So I'm here waiting outside of this building. I've called them several times. I've called both their New York office and their DC office. Yeah, something fishy is going on here. They don't want to answer any questions. Even after they told us to retract our article, they're not explaining why. They're not giving us any information. I'm going to go walk in there and see if I can go up to their floor and talk to them. Let's see if I can get through. Hi. Um, to sign in as a visitor uh, for Eurasia Group, just on here. You, you, you have um, appointment today? Uh, no, 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 we're calling. We're, I'm a reporter looking to speak with them uh, in regards to a story we're running. Yeah, you need to talk to Could you would you be able to ring them? No, I we don't have. Uh, we don't have uh, telephone number. Now, I guess I'm not surprised. I am, however, disappointed. We're not going to quit digging on this file. This story is huge. Even though uh, the liberal elite don't want us reporting on it, uh, they put us on public notice. I don't know what that means. Gerald Butts tweeted this earlier this week, just yesterday, actually, I think it was. I don't know what public notice means. I don't know if it's a threat for a lawsuit or if this was just a dog whistle to the liberal party's leashed and collared mainstream media. We all remember when Telford said that she could get anyone to write any helpful op-ed that the Prime Minister's office needed. Something fishy is going on here at the Eurasia Group in New York. We're not sure what extent the relationship goes to with Gerald Butts, but we're going to keep digging, we're going to keep filing ATIPs, and we're going to get to the bottom of this. For the Rebel.media, I'm Kean Bex. Hey there, thanks for watching our exclusive coverage here at The Rebel. We're breaking exclusive stories all the time, so be sure to like and subscribe to us. But beyond that, even if you've already subscribed, click the notification bell because subscriptions don't mean all of that much here on YouTube. And you want to stay up to date with all of the stories as they happen. If you want to stay up to date on Twitter, you can follow me at TheRealKean.